Today, I'm going to make a cinematic and epic poster for the Avengers Age of Ultron movie using Photoshop. And I'm going to show you how you can make it by yourself. Welcome back, guys, to a brand new video. As you've heard in the intro today, we're making a cinematic and epic poster for Avengers Age of Ultron movie. And yeah, if you're a Marvel fan, leave a like and subscribe. Now, without wasting any more time, let's get into the Photoshop. So here we are in the Photoshop. First of all, I dragged in this Rubble House image and masked out the rubble kind of rocks using Quick Selection Tool. Then I determined the right position for it. Then I dragged in Rubble Image and masked it out using Quick Selection. And determined the right position for it as well. Then I dragged in the sky image and scaled it. Then I dragged in another sky image and added an inverted mask on it, and then painted on the white glowing areas of the sky. Then I removed their saturation and added a bluish color tone using color balance. I blended in the foreground with the sky as well. I grouped the both rubble images and then I made them darker using level and made it bluish using color balance. Now it's starting to match with the sky. Then I dragged in the Iron Man and determined the right position for him. Then I dragged in the Ultron and determined his position. Then I also dragged in the Captain America and determined the right position for him as well. I guess it's kind of boring to say the same thing again and again. I dragged in other characters as well and determined their positions. Then I made a sun in the right corner using solid color. Then I added an exposure layer and clipped it with Iron Man and decreased the exposure at all and inverted the mask and painted it using brush tool by selecting the white color. And this how I painted shadows on Iron Man. Then I painted the shadows on the other characters as well. Enjoying the video? Leave a like and subscribe now. It motivates me to make more content for you guys. Then using color balance, I blended them with the environment as well. Then I added highlights on all of them as well using solid color.
add some depth, I painted some haze or smoke between all the characters. I took a solid color and selected a light bluish color and panted it using a smoke brush to add some smoke. As you can see now, we can see some depth in between the characters. Then I added some demolished buildings in the background and blended them with the environment as well. By the way, I almost forgot to add these two characters, so I dragged in the Hawkeye and Quicksilver and blended them with the environment as well. Then I added some demolished building in the front and blend them as well. Then I also added some fire overlays. Then I added the fire highlights on all the characters as well. Everything is done now, I'm going to add some final effects and a camera raw to spice it up. Well guys, that's it for this video. Hope you liked the video. I've also made a poster for The Avengers one. 
If you want to see that video, click on that i button. If you like this video, make sure to leave a like and feel very free to subscribe. And hope we will meet again in the next video. Bye-bye.